What's going on guys? It's Gio here, bringing you another video. The video I'm showing you today is going to be about the nuclear reactor in Tekkit 1.6.4. Now, uh, as many of you know, I'm just going to, ah, I'm just going to jump right into this video. Alright, so first thing you need to do is create a little area underneath, above, doesn't really matter where you go. Probably better to have it a long ways uh, underground from your house, because if it explodes, game set match. So you need a 3x3 three three little pool, you need a hazmat suit, that'll allow you to carry the actual reactor core, you need a thermometer, <clears throat> you need uh, the energy cell, which is a good idea to have, oh, looks like I forgot my piston I'm also going to need, that works in conjunction with the thermometer, the control rod, which will turn off the reactor if it's necessary. If it, if it begins to overheat, and the fissel fuel rod. It's actually really easy to make the fissel fuel rod. So, first things first, in the middle, drop the reactor cell. That's probably the reason a 3x3 is really nice. Uh, then you got your thermometer. There, and we'll just get a little bit of space to uh, have the fuel rod working. Now I have to put in the control and the piston for to hook up to the thermometer. If it uh, overheats or if it hits our threshold, uh, then you can then it'll shut off automatically without exploding. That's the whole premise of the thermometer. So let's drop the piston in here. Come on, swim. Piston down. Control rod down. <coughs> Now, to sync this all up, we also need to have redstone carry the current. Oh, that would have been dangerous. Water would have been everywhere. Alright, so we'll get our redstone going. And because we're deep underneath, it doesn't really matter what this actually looks like. So you can see it's set at 2300. One right click will actually change the temperature on there. So, best to have that lower than higher. <laughs> so now we're going to place our turbines. And we're going to place all nine of them down. Because you're going to see something real fancy here. Now, if you think if you use the wrench, I thought it was you click anyone, but it turns out it's actually the uh, middle one. Boom. All right. Turbine is complete. So, now... As you can see, I use the most expensive uh, energy conduits and a resident energy cell, which are the most difficult ones to make. But I'm not actually building this stuff, <clears throat> so it really doesn't matter. If I were building this in my uh, playthrough series, I would definitely use the other one. I don't know if it matters if that could just stick on the side or not. It might. might uh, I don't know if it actually matters. It's just the way it's connected to the to there. I don't think it really matters. So now I'm going to take this and send it up to the quarry. And actually, let's fix this. I think. Yeah. Yeah, I'll fix that. Yeah, so I'll put a resonant energy cell there. I think red is in, orange is out. Part of the reason I use the resident energy cells is because the max input is crazy high. Alright. Oh, it's almost night time. Not anymore, mole fuckers. Silly Geo, you should actually probably put the conduit to the quarry. And turn that one on. Boom. Alright. Let's go fire this bad boy up. Yeah, so if you don't uh, have a biohazard suit or hazmat suit on, when you pick that thing up, you get poisoned. <laughs> so now I've got to put this back into the core. Boom. That's powered up. And as you'll see, it's spinning. So that's awesome. Can't go out that way. Let's go back up here. We'll go see how insanely fast the core is working. 
once I turn it on, of course, because I have the input. I have the input out. Oh, backwards. Yeah, holy guacamole! That's insane how fast this goes up. So I'll turn the max app output on to say eighteen hundred. Boom. That is building the quarry insanely fast. So, anyways, guys, that is the end of this video, and yeah, who knew? Reactors in Tekkit, great power source. I have no idea how long a core lasts. Uh, someone watches this video and they know. Feel free to let the rest of us know. Boom! That quarry is flying. Catch you later, guys.